What's up everyone? God bless you and hope everyone's having an amazing blessed day. I wanted to come in here live to actually speak to you a little bit about something that I've been speaking about for years and I never actually addressed it or explained myself about it, right? Struggle for me is kind of like a negative way of addressing that life is a challenge, right? So for me, the way I see struggle is a challenge of life. And the way I used to say it is that challenges are meant to be overcome. And sometimes we struggle so much that we don't even see that there's a challenge happening because we're so focused on the struggle. And I believe that if we change the way we say the situation that we're going through, it might be a lot more understanding for us to overcome it. So my challenge to all of you that are struggling in anything and everything in life, whatever it is, if it's relationship, business, uh, coaching, is whatever it is that you're struggling with right now, losing weight, uh, gaining weight, um, positivity, negative, whatever you're struggling with right now, I want you to change the way you address it. I want you to start actually saying, the challenges that I'm currently facing are going to make me better because this is a learning experience for what's coming next. Because what we say, what comes out of our mouth will become our reality. So if we begin to start changing the way we address life, situations, struggles, challenges, whatever, we're going to get better at it. We're going to improve the quality of our life. But it has to start with how we speak to ourselves. Not to other people, but to ourselves. Because our main struggles in life are something that somebody planted in us. And we believed it. Because we were ignorant. We didn't know. We didn't understand. We wasn't aware that it was happening. But it's there. A lot of our current struggles are based on past situations, on past moments, on people who planted something in us without us realizing that it was planted in us. So I want to challenge you to ask yourself this question. What am I currently struggling in that I need to work on to improve the quality of my life? And if you start doing that, if you start improving those little things in your life, I guarantee you that you're going to get better. I guarantee you that the way things are going to start manifesting in your life, it's going to shock you. All because of the way you worded it to change what's going on in your life right now. For me personally, guys... I always struggled growing up. I struggled with weight loss. I struggled with pleasing people. I struggled with business. I struggled with understanding my personal attitude towards situations or things. Listen, I doubt myself too. Just like all of you doubt yourself, I do too. But I don't, I'm not perfect. That just defines that I'm not perfect. And It's okay not to be perfect. The problem is that the reason why we struggle so much because we're so focused on perfection that we forget the beauty that life is showing us. And life shows us beauty every single day. There's a movie that Will Smith did called Collateral Beauty that to me, the minute that I saw that movie from start to finish, I already knew what it meant. Because that's the life that I live. It's the life that I believe in. And I think if more people watch the movie for what it is, not because of the actors or the actresses, you're going to really understand how collateral beauty really means. Meaning that all these things that we go through, all these struggles, all these adversities, all these setbacks have something beautiful at the end of it. But we have to realize that. We have to become aware of it. 
We have to understand what's happening so that we can have the faith to overcome it. Because faith is possibilities. But we have to believe it. We have to want it. And if we don't want it, we're not going to get it. Don't put yourself down to make someone feel better about themselves. Stay true to who you are. Because eventually who you are is a gift to somebody else. And I want to help you do that. I want to inspire you to do that. These videos are something that I've always wanted to do. But I always doubted myself that others might not like it or maybe they might not understand. And I, you play with your own head. Mr. Positive, I am. I'm always positive, but sometimes doubtful. I'm human. It happens. But I show up every day. I do the things that I need to do every day. Can I get to where I want to be in life? Absolutely. I just got to stay consistent to it. So with that being said, I want you today to change the word struggle to challenge because challenges are meant to be overcome. So if you're facing a certain struggle right now, guys, do me one favor. Comment below. Share the struggle. Let's work together on how to overcome it. And tell yourself, this is the current challenge that I'm facing what do I need to do on a daily basis, mentally, emotionally, to get over it? And do it one day at a time. Because that one day turns into two, the two turns into three, and three goes into four, etc., cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So whatever it is you want to overcome in life, guys, always remember these three things. Become aware that it exists. Understand why it exists. And have faith that you can overcome it. And I promise you that the altitude of vision that's going to be created in your mind is going to blow you away. God bless you. Always remember, please always remember to have faith, not fear. Why? Because faith always ignites the healing that you're seeking. God bless you. Let's go.